We start off the new arc by kicking the third prince's balls and crushing his bloodline. I think he's the third prince. Maybe he's the second prince. Rest in peace, David's balls. Danora's technique, right? The Danora arts. It, it does many things. Driving, archery, kicking nuts. But it's cool to see Danora actually pop off to it. I want to see more from her. Now, this new arc is basically, um, there's a new dark god. Yes, there's multiple dark gods. And the king of Mani is like, hey, uh, go below and, um, and kill them. And uh, you'll be like a hero or some shit. I forget. And he also killed like one of those killed uh, the Eroge hero, right? Whatever that Eroge guy was, that was fucking hilarious. Now, there's so many characters so many new plots being introduced so i gotta focus let's begin today's reaction oh that's the, that's, the, that's the evil sage uh sigil seagull aoi is in fetal position now ever since the yogini incident see on see on right oh my god remember she was like she tried to appraise the yogini it was like Brr error and it's like the end of all things and now he started shitting her bed literally got her, on her knees and fucking just crawled out right right Okay, Aoi Hayanose, a sage assassin, was pursuing Yogiri and Tomochika but ran away in fear. So is she also a sage? I guess she's not. She has powers though. That's not the sage's gift, but she assass assassinates, right? I'm not sure if this is a sage assassin as in an assassin that assassinates sages or like she's a sage but she's also an assassin. Maybe it's both. No shit, he's not human. He's Alpha Omega. Not even a living thing? Wait, the dagger's talking? The weapon is talking? I honestly don't remember the weapon talking. Maybe I should have focused more before. Holy shit, I didn't know Aoi's weapon could talk. My bad, my bad. This fucking guy, oh my god, please. Yeah, how? Yeah? So I'm stronger than the Dark God? Don't tell me this is the key to another Dark God. Because, like, she just said, I have someone that's even stronger than our Dark God. What if it's just Dark God number two? But okay, this tentacle key, what is it? What are you opening? What? Whoa, 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 whoa. Key to the seal! The dark god sealed the sister away? Have we seen <laughs> What the fuck was that? He's on his knees! Huh? Wait, didn't she do this? Didn't Aoi do the same thing too? When she was running away from Yogiri? I swear to god, Aoi did something similar to this, right? <laughs> And she's fast though. <laughs> He's so self-aware. <laughs> Honestly, I hate this guy. And he's been like the most hated character from episode one. But death is too easy of a way out. I do enjoy that he keeps getting tortured like this. But fuck, dude. He gets a lot of screen time, man. Wait. Is, is, is she really a Shota? What, what what did I understand around Aoi is the lolly in this instant, right? Right? The to sorry, oh the tomboy is Aoi, right? Wait! This is a femboy? Oh, oh I I I I don't know, he's just it's a guy it's a guy. It's a guy. It's a guy. It's a feminine guy. Right. Not a Shota. Shota's like a little boy, right? Good job not spoiling me guys. I'm proud of you guys. Yeah. This king is a giga chat, dude. King of Mani. Mm. Okay, oh wait, wait. Okay, he didn't die. He just cut his hand off. My bad, man. The royal family has the ability to cause a gift to weaken. Interesting mechanic. Damn. All right, the distance kind of matters, so you can reattach it now? Tomochi. Tomochi? No one knows who he is, I guess. Oh, we were worried about... Uh, What's his name again? You! Yeah, you! I don't know his name. <laughs> what is that look? Yes, Yogiri is here. Interesting looks here, huh? The middle blonde girl looks very interested, but the one to the right looks fucking disgusted, dude. The fuck? These rural family more? Oh, it's a sword master! Right, 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 because the sword master did survive! Right? 
No, 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 no not, not, not the sword master. Sorry, sorry, sorry. The, 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 the thing with it, that was like with the dark god, right? The girl with the dark god. Dark god died because Yogi killed, but we released the seal. Divine king. That's a, that's this is the divine king. We're still following him? Polaris? Church is usually evil. The divine king, head of the Axis church, kept... Uh-oh. Usually, the church is always bad in Isekai, right? Unless it's like a wrong way to use healing magic. So I'm just gonna just doubt everyone here. But the divine king is probably good. But everyone around there probably bad? Who is we? Who are these church people? Key? Uh, a ceiling key? Huh? Oh, but the key basically like the tentacle key, like the, you know, for the little sister of the dark god. So, okay, the church is already just showing their true colors. Uh, 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 uh. Anyways. <laughs> I don't think my decision to leave you behind was a wrong move. Now, I'm sorry. There's so many characters I've straight up forgotten. So, when did he leave us behind? When did he betray us? Who is this dude? Was this the guy that was a contractor or the gov- Remember the job that I made fun of? In the bus. Was he on the bus? Have we met him after the bus though? Nothing after the bus? Doesn't matter, right? And, and, remember, holy shit, I forgot. On the bus, remember, we have the android girl too, remember? Holy shit, the intro of last episode, there was that setup with that girl too, right? Jesus Christ, gotta, gotta forget, I gotta remember that too. He's the commander? All right, all right. He's a general. She didn't deny it. Oh, who this girl? Pink girl? She Class idol? These jobs are hilarious. I love, I, I love that at least they're trying to like give us like real jobs or like random like unique jobs, right? Like instead of just like warrior, tank, you know, necromancer, thief, you know, it's like government, general, contractor, accountant, idol. <laughs> okay, so has a skill cut. She, she has a, a skill called Vow, where in exchanging for pledging an oath to her, the other party's abilities are strengthened. What's the oath though? That sounds like a du ah no 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 but, but you can get stronger but that oath okay she's a famous idol both at school and in the entertainment business I can't trust you guys the general would Yazaki who is he uh, who the fuck is Yazaki what I honestly don't know dude who 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 I hope this is the anime poking fun in itself because there's so many fucking characters, right? The, like the who are you guys? The, the author straight up has to be memeing, right? It's like, yes, my audience, I understand we are spamming the shit out of these characters that will kill immediately. So we're poking jabs at it. Yes, this is all part of the running gag. All right, all right. Yugo Izumida, he's a cook. Uh, cool. Yukimasa Aya, I'm not gonna remember this shit. He's a reader. <laughs> I was gonna be like, he's a reader? What do you mean, reader? I can read too. But basically, you can read any language. Gotcha. <laughs> Fellow class losers? <laughs> we? Speak for yourself. <laughs> what? Insect hunter. Causes instant death to all insects. Cover story. What? I... I... It... Are we memeing? Is he using some skill to hide? Fake identity, right? It's fake info, but how are we faking it, though? The cover- Okay, the cover- Sorry, sorry. When I read the cover story, I didn't understand it, interpret it as, this is a cover story for us. I thought it's like, read the cover story of this fucking light novel to understand why he's an insect hunter. All right, whatever. Okay, last episode, we got a courier. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. We can hide our status and just kind of fake it. Gotcha, gotcha. Insect hunter. <laughs> Reader, wow. <laughs> Who is it? Gotta be another guy, right? My bad. I thought this is a girl when, cause this is the other person in that. You know, when I showed you that pause scene with the blonde girl in the middle, that's the one that was looking at us bad, right? Seichi Fukai, death god, causes instant death. No, 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 no. That's Yogi. No, that's Yogi. Wait. There has been mentions multiple times about instant death magic, right? Which I don't think Yogiri has, because Yogiri is like Alpha Omega. Instant death magic is a gift 
we never got a gift. He got that gift? He? Because Sion was talking about like, does he have instant death magic, right? So is, is, is that what he is? <laughs> yeah, Eroge Master. We cut his hand off. Eroge Master, he's a clown. <laughs> he's just a master of Eroge Vision. <laughs> What is an Eroge Meister? You have a master and a Meister. <laughs> All right, we got Keichi Munakata kun. <laughs> I should have seen this coming. All right, which one's next? Like, we got Eroge Master, Meister, Maniac, and Eroge King. Do we have a king? <laughs> the three Eroge nobles. You know what? I love shit like this. I love it when an anime like has like titles like the seven spears of you know the West, the the ten overlords, <laughs> the three Eroge nobles. <laughs> yeah, that's them. That's right. They love Eroge. What? Okay. The time stop is insane, though, don't you think so? Time stop is fucking insane. The x ray is kind of stupid. He's just pure fan service. Like, these are obviously all, like, creepy shit, right? You time stop to, you know. And then, you know, the x ray vision to be like. <laughs> and then the tentacles to be like. <laughs> you know, but. Okay, alright. The tentacles in the time stop is actually kind of pretty OP. Maybe. Oh, it's these girls again. Wow, they remember this name. So. Lord Okakushi. So there's no reason to leave everything to you, the taker of souls. Lord Okakushi? O Okakushi? Do I, do I know this name? Where do we hear this fucking... Where did, where did we hear Lord Okakushi from before? Did anyone ever say that? He recognized that though, right? He recognized the name Lord Okakushi, right? Whoa, 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 whoa. Lord Okakushi? In the lab? Was his, was his name in the... I thought he's Alpha Omega. But he's Alpha Omega and Lord Okakushi. Okay, okay, okay. And then a death god. So there's no reason to leave everything to you, the taker. See, so he has so many titles! Yogiri! Insect Hunter! Lord Okakushi! Death god! Taker of souls! Dude, hey, how many titles does he have? Okay. So he's from the lab? He's from the lab. Okay, I take back I take back my instant death magic shit then, cause he's from the Doesn't he have a gift though still? I don't know how that works. But his class is a death god. Maybe he's faking the class plate too. I don't fucking know. Did you just gouge your eye out? Okay. It's fake eye, it's a fake eye, it's a fake eye. Jesus, that was fucking dramatic. I thought he gouged his eyes out because he said I can't make eye contact. This is an eye that can detect the supernatural. Lost the power to detect supernatural. I know you haven't unleashed your power here. What do you mean here? Does here mean this room? This, this place? Or are you saying this world? Because we did use instant death unless he's implying he has actual other powers what do you mean what do you mean no no what <laughs> why oh yeah carol's the one that i made a comparison directly from carol from tomo-chan yeah we saw her before it's been a couple episodes was she the one that said the gate has opened remember like one of those like ending scenes in one of the episodes i swear to god they said the gate's about to open then we went into the sword master arc but it's her right yeah first gate is open what does that mean and she's a samurai gotcha the gate is open so he can kill us instantly if the gate's closed, he can't use it. So remember how like every time he uses his powers in the earlier episodes, there's like, a couple visual cues. We always see like he goes to his eyes and like a gate opens. But sometimes it's like a bell noise too. So if a gate is, and there's first gate, in play there's multiple gates. And because the gate is open, he can do the killing. But if the gate is closed, he can't do the killing? What does that mean? <laughs> <laughs> Giga chat Carol. The agency! Remember, the agency is the one that kidnapped, you know, uh, I forgot her name, you know, our big sister, the quote unquote big sister, right? So, agency and Ryoko is from the institute. So, agency is like the, the mega corp, right? Like this big unknown entity that has like control over the institute where the lab workers are, right? Am I correct in that? She's a ninja, gotcha. 
Fukai is from the cult? Agency? Institute? We know these two. But there's a cult. Death God cult? Lord Okakushi cult? Cult of Diablos? Wrong anime. Alright. What thing? What, what thing? What thing, huh? What, 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 what? Oh, it's our sister, Euphemia. Sisters unite! No, never mind. Whoa, 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 what the fuck? Who are you? Who the fuck are you? I know who Euphemia is, but I will become the heir to the origin blood. Okay. Focus? Stay locked in. All right, origin bloods? What is that? Okay. If she somehow takes Euphemia, you get the origin bloods, right? Vampire origins? Ooh, Lane. Oh, mm. So she has Lane's memory. Did Lane's like powers activate there? So Euphemia has Lane's powers, I guess, because obviously Lane like turned her into a vampire. So she technically has like progenitor origin vampire blood. And that's what this girl was after. And this magic here was activated instinctively. I don't know, but she has like Lane Sama's memories and kind of the powers. All right. That's so sad! That's so sad! Usually, every character that gets, like, killed instantly, like, they at least show some, like, introduction, you know? It's, like, name, class, and a description of what they do, but it's, like, bye-bye. Bye-bye. Her design was nice, but I'm pretty used to a bunch of waifus just dying left and right. Okay, the idol, Val. And the classmates she uses them on aren't allowed to use their gifts? Well, I thought the Val makes you stronger with the oath, but the classmates she uses them on aren't allowed to use their gifts. Interesting. Even if you get the vow and you make, it str you make them stronger, they can't use gifts anymore? What's the purpose of that? We didn't know whether or not Erogate Meister, remember? Master Meister Maniac? <laughs> Akino-san the reader? I love Carol's voice actor. You guys don't want to go home? Maybe? Okay, we're going to leave everyone out. I think we can't trust them, right? Fukai, Carol, the samurai girl, it feels like they are on our side. I don't know, it's just like they were surveilling us, but who knows? Batu! Oh, and the ninja! The ninja! What the fuck is this? The idol. I mean, she says that this has really good defense value, but like, it's it could be way worse, right? Like, come on, like, at least she's covering everything, right? At least they didn't just put her in a fucking string like a bikini and say, yep, this is the highest defense gear for girls. Sure, I'll believe you. I'm a ninja! <laughs> Samurai outfit. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> <laughs> who the fuck are you? Class cheerleader. I straight up don't even know who this one is. All right, we have a cheerleader too. We have Yui Otani. Races others' abilities with cheers. Great, all right. She, she, she just cheers. She just cheers. This is a dressmaker. Okay. Yo, Danora's outfit though. Yo, Danora finally got that outfit we saw in the opening. So, Tomochika Danora, her fake identity, self centered blacksmith, can create weapons and protective gear. For her own personal use. Cover story. Skin tight. Damn, that's crazy. That's a skin tight bodysuit. And on top of the skin tight bodysuit, you have like a translucent veil around it. That's like immaculate drip. Like that is like the aesthetic design choice of this. It's like, it's beautiful. Yeah, you, it's your cover story. Remember? The guide. Rick! Hey! We got Rick back! David. Wait, wait. Does it say... Oh, I, I wish the, the new introduction for David would have been like, Vice Captain of the Royal Captain Guard at the Castle Gates, a member of the royal family who lost his ability to reproduce thanks to Danora in episode 8. You know, that would have been hilarious. My power can completely suppress a demonic creature of low, only low ranks. Oh, this guy! This guy is the funniest one! He's a consultant! 
<laughs> he's straight up a fucking consultant. <laughs> well, honestly, if, if if memes aside, right? Memes aside, he couldn't become a samurai or like a ninja, but consultant, he problem solves, right? Honestly, if he's able to like solve any problem like ever, then that's like a giga chat fucking skill. In fact, I think one of the most OP anime skills that I saw, right? One of the most OP anime skills uh, I remember, I think it's from a series called Zatch Bell. It's a long old ass shonen series. I haven't seen it completely, but there is an ability called Answer Talker, where it's like any situation you can, sorry, you can hear my rice cooker right now. You can basically like, um, Answer Talker allows you to analyze any situation and solve the problem no matter what. You will always have the most objective answer to any problem, right? So maybe consultant skill is really OP, man. Okay, so David can suppress demons and humans. I want to see the cheerleader cheer. Come on. I want to see the cheerleader go like this, man. Is he the first prince? He is, right? What's Tanora doing? Where, where are we going? Alright. Well, kick... I mean, you can't kick that in the nuts. Just snap his leg off. Tanora can literally just summon weapons, right? Yeah? I need something heavy and Moku Moku will straight up just pull out a weapon and no one can see Moku Moku here except us. Yogiri can see, but like everyone, uh, uh, our classmates can't see Moku Moku. Okay. Is there a reason why people can't see Moku Moku? Remember, if you spoil me, I'm gonna ban you. Remember, if you spoil me, I'm gonna ban you. The fuck? He's acting like he's a consultant. Because he can't just use instant death, so he actually has to, like, you know, at least try to, like, kill things with the weapon now. Gotcha. <laughs> Bro, I don't want you as my leader. Get the fuck out of my face. Uh, uh, rookie luck. Beginner's luck. Yeah. What about the instant death bug killing power? So we can only use instant death on bugs right now, right? Because that's our, like, that's our identity, right? Insect killer. So we're limited to only bugs. Oh, my God. Wait. That's not her. Remember the Shota? That's no. And this is not the Dark God sister either. This, we didn't, we, that's the girl? Was that her power to transform back to different states? Did she have a power like that? Honestly, I honestly don't remember. It, but it, 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 it is him. All right, he has girl mode too. I don't fucking, are you guys just spoiling me? Are you fucking spoiling me? Are you fucking trolling me? I don't know anymore. No. <laughs> He's ruining, <laughs> she's ruining the immersion. <laughs> <laughs> He's been pretty cheeky now, man. So maybe the dark god is the younger sister, right? So it's always oh, it's gonna be the dark. Is it? Would it be a goddess? Whatever. I'm very impressed at this anime because there's a, not a single background character here that's been copy pasted or looks like CGI. It's actually very impressive. Yeah, you're the origin vampire shit. Lane. Lolly form incoming. Oh, what? Wow, what are the odds? Whoa, no way. Who would have thought? Hello, Lane. Ah, uh, instinctively. Gotcha. Your name is Lane now. Lane. Rizzly? All right, Rizzly it is. I thought it'd be Lane Jr. Fifth level of the underworld. The people are happy about that. Gotcha. All right. How many levels are there? Huh? The recognition blocker is OP, man. Hey, what are you, what are you doing? What are you doing? Careful now. Oh, bro, he never stashed up the beautiful girls from you. Those beautiful girls never even saw you as actual potential partners to me. Like you are not actual men to them. You understand that? Yogiri being there or not doesn't affect your chances to get with them. Holy shit! Why do I feel like this guy should have just ended his sentence there by saying De gozaru. De gozaru. Oh. No, 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 you're getting baited. Who is this? If you proceed, then you die, right? Who the fuck? Oh, <laughs> The three nobles versus android. Uh. Tentacle. Uh. 
What did the Eroge guy do? What, what, what happened? Did he stop time and like, you know, harass her? Oh my, is she... She straight up just killed him with fists? Holy fuck, he left her to die? Did the I don't remember the Eroge Meister being there with the with the wife with the girls, but uh, okay, all right. I, I guess she got betrayed. All right, holy fuck. One a day. Every classmate, cause they all abandoned her. I like this. I'm a fan. I like this. I'm a big fan right now. Let's fucking go. And my biggest question last episode was like, I have no idea which faction she's part of, right? Because like she's turned into an android and there's like different things I was like talking to her. And my best guess was like, is this like, does this have to do with the aggressors? Because the, the aggressors seems like a little like futuristic, you know, technology. I don't know. That's my best guess. But it's not the, the aggressors then. Completely separate faction. Good. One a day. The entire bar runs out. <gasps> nah, you know this piece of shit's gonna live to the fucking end, dude. Plus with recognition blog, it'll probably like bypass that. <laughs> I knew it was going to be Sion because I was carefully looking at her toes. Because they introduced her feet in the beginning too. In this episode, I was like, hmm, whose feet is this? And then it was Sion. So I was like, hmm, instantly, instantly, instantly. I'm good. I'm locked in. I'm locked in. Sion can override the recognition block. I may be able to recognize her feet, but I don't know her name. Not Sion. Sion. My bad. Bye-bye. Slowly backing out. Yeah. She could kill you if you wanted, right? That's right, and you can sense that murderous intent and do long distance killing. Nah, we're gonna use you. This Shota is getting too cocky. She really thinks that you can take out Yogiri? There's no way! Like, you're the Dark God's apprentice. We killed the Dark God while he was fucking sealed. Like, what do you think you're gonna do? Yeah, you're the underling. No! Is he gonna die this episode? Ah, I mean, he did leave nine episodes, and I did say death is too easy of a way out, but he has been tortured plenty, and honestly, seeing him on every episode kind of pisses me off. Maybe I'm down for this. <laughs> Goodbye! Good people never die, but the shitty people live to the fucking end. This is so fucking true. My heat rage trans. Form to whipped cream? Wait, maybe that wasn't that wasn't intentional. Wait, are we gonna ignore the fact that the heat turned to whipped cream? I straight up don't know his power because I don't think it has really been described, right? It's just like, oh, hey, there's this person. It's a uh, Dark Lord's uh, apprentice. That's about it. Bye bye. More interesting is that the Sion didn't realize that it was her that did it. He turned Frederica's arm into candy in the previous episode. Oh, yeah! Honestly, with so much details being thrown out, it's hard to memorize little details like that, but oh, yeah, that did happen. That did happen, yeah. It's got to do with sweets always, huh? It was a candy, it's like cream this time, interesting. It's only... Basically, it's fucking like Majin Buu. It's just fucking... It's just the base Majin Buu just, you know, turning into candy and eat it. Bro fucking lives again. And I have no idea what this anime is, man. Nobody! <laughs> is he always playing Monster Hunter on his DS? Okay. Seventh level is the Dark God's sister, probably? Oh, it's already been one month almost? Meister and the uh, other guy's alive, the maniac? She was, until Android. Okay, it's Sion and her... Our toy boy, boy toy. The fuck? Why? Why would you do that? Who is it? I mean, he does have problem solving skills. <laughs> See, this is the thing I said. I told you. The problem solving skills, the consultant seems like a fucking meme until you realize he literally has the answers to anything. Any situation. I don't know the limitation, but if he truly is able to come up with a solution for anything, it's fucking cracked. He should have a solution to escape this place, huh? Go back to Earth to not be a sage. Yogi is definitely not trying his best. 
What's the payment? That is another episode with so much plot. Yo, I swear to God, I'm really trying, guys. I'm not the smartest person, but I try to really focus, okay, to compensate for that. And I, I, I every episode, it feels like there's a fire hydrant that just goes full force. And I'm just like, and it's just like new characters, new characters, new characters, new plot, new plot, new plot. Three separate subplots. You remember this character before? I didn't, I didn't either. Oh my God, it's, it's so fucking hard. It's so fucking hard. It's so fucking hard. It's so fucking hard. I need the help of chat. Straight up, I need the fucking chat to literally remind me of all these different things. I, I try my best, man, but shit, a lot of details I forget. But basically, basically what's happening is one month deadline, get to the seventh floor, Dark God's sister probably is the Dark God here. That's kind of a zoom, right? We have the agency. We have the institute. Then we have a cult as well. Three separate factions. We've got Android thing that's coming back to attack the Edogay nobles and, and the rest of the class. And we have another subplot with the, 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 the divine king and the church. And the, 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 and the, uh, this is hard. This is hard, but we're getting through it. We're getting through it, and we'll continue with the next episode. But hey, if you're still here, if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for more content. And until next time, take care.